After 10 years of looking for this diagnosis, I finally made the diagnosis. I had a patient come in with confusion and low heart rate. They were recently admitted at another facility, and it was thought that her low heart rate and her confusion had a lot to do with her blood pressure medicine she was on. It was called a beta blocker. So they took her off of that blood pressure medicine, and that helped her heart rate, and that helped her confusion. Now, her heart rate was low, but she didn't have something called a second or third degree heart block. That is, the top part was doing a good job of talking to the bottom part of the heart. This patient came back, and they ended up doing a lot worse. The heart rate was low, they were confused, but now there was swelling in the legs, the blood pressure was low, and the temperature was low. So they were hypothermic, hypotensive, bradycardic, confused, and they had this fluid on their legs. So what diagnosis neatly packages all of them up together? I mean, I looked to make sure that they had good heart function. I looked at a recent echo and it was normal, but this patient ended up having a condition where their thyroid levels are extremely low. This is called myxedema coma, and this can be very deadly. And basically the thyroid is responsible for regulating metabolism and energy levels. So if your energy levels are extremely low in your body, that can just lead to all sorts of downstream effects. This patient not only needs thyroid hormone in IV form called IV levothyroxine, they also need supportive care. You need to get that blood pressure up. You need to get that heart rate up. This particular patient did require vasopressors. So she, she was pretty sick. Hope she does extremely well. I think she will.